What's up, guys? We're back looking at some more MLB player props today over on Prize Picks. We went 2 0 in yesterday's MLB video, which means we have now cashed six of our last eight plays in these YouTube videos. Let's stay cashing and let's get some more winners in this video. Let's hop in. Before we do so, though, don't miss out in joining the Dub Club. You guys can get all my plays sent straight to you. And right now, it's one of the biggest offers that I offer. I pretty much do this only on weekends. Get it right now for literally just $5. For the next two weeks, you get all my plays in my best package for only five dollars. And you can see here that my price picks profit is over five thousand dollars. My sleeper profit is over thirteen hundred dollars. Says how you guys know that I'm not a bum out there selling shitty plays. And I'm not even profit myself. So not every day will be a winning day, but long term, I've always profited. I'm also profitable on chalkboard, underdog, and sports books. So don't miss out on getting all my plays sent straight to you. Link for the Dub Club is down in my description. Five dollars. For the next two weeks, don't miss out because think about it. We also have the NFL coming up here next week. One of my best sports for sure. We have some college football coming up as well. Just some college football plays. And we still have a ton of the MLB season left. Don't miss out. $5 for two weeks down in my description or in the comment section. And also one final thing before we get into these plays is if you want to research player props for yourself, in my opinion, you have to have a research tool and Outlier can be that for you. It's the tool that I personally use to research all my player props. You'll see me use it in this video, but if you want it for yourself, there's a seven day free trial down in my description if you use that promo link. You also can download their app on the app store to research player props right from your phone. So if you guys want it, and if you guys like what you see from this tool in this video, check it out for yourself, seven day free trial down in my description. With all that out of the way, let's get to these pledges. Make sure you play responsibly at your own risk. Leave a like on the video and subscribe. I really would appreciate it. Most important thing though is having those post notifications turned on so that way you don't miss future uploads and you get in before Slim and Zion's move and get bumped, things like that. Let's get into it here. The first player prop I like for today's slate. We're getting a little bit fancy here. We're going with two two players combined into one. Since they're both goblins, it'll make more sense as I get into it here. But let's focus on the first one here. We're actually going to go with today Blake Snell over 17 and a half pitching outs here. This one's definitely a little bit interesting. You see what he's done in his last five games over in four of his last five, including four straight. Uh, just kind of bear with me here when I explain this here. But I like this one also paired with Yandy Diaz here. So we're going to go ahead and pull him up. I like him to have a hit in today's game. So this may not make too much sense because you're like, why would you just do two green goblins together? They only pay out 1.8x. The point of this is to just pair with a normal play. So if you were to pair this with like Corey Seager, for example, this would actually pay out a 3.2x. So basically this is like one square combined because if you parlay them on a sports book, it pays out about a plus 100. So hopefully I'm kind of making a little bit of sense here. So you're not just doing these two combined. You add a third play into it, if that kind of makes sense, to get about a 3, 3.2x payout. Anyway, let's get into uh, my reasoning for why I like Snell and Yandy Diaz today. So you see what Blake Snell has done this year. He is over this in quite a few games this year, especially as of late. He was limited a lot of starts earlier this year, which is why he was only throwing, you know, 70 pitches, 85 pitches, and not really going super deep into games. But as of late, he's been really good. He's over in seven of his last eight games, but he is coming off of a rough game against Seattle. He only went three innings in that game. He threw about 74 pitches, and he walked about six guys in that game. However, this is a great bounce back spot for him because not only is this matchup great, I mean, it's Miami. They rank 29th in offense versus lefties this year. Their batting average has stayed pretty bad. They've been a little bit better in the last 30 games, but I'm not really super worried about that. But one of the main reasons why I like this so much is that this is insane. I don't think I've seen this the entire season so far, but Blake Snell is favored, heavily favored, under one and a half earned runs. That's insane. You don't really ever see that from really any pitcher. I don't know how many times I've seen that this year. Uh, very, very few. Blake Snell is favored under one and a half earned runs. That's really crazy. That is a great sign for the over 17 and a half outs. Also, take a look at the walks here. He is slightly favored over one and a half, which is a good sign considering there's plenty of games where he's walked three, four, or even six people. So I think it should be a really nice spot here for the over for Blake Snell. Love the matchup. I love the lines from today, especially with that. If he's not getting shelled, I don't know why they pull him before going six innings. Uh, there's no weather or anything like that. Looks like it would, that looks like it will impact this game or anything like that. Should be a weather delay or anything like that. Uh, it's a great matchup. I don't see why Blake Snell can't cover this line. I think it's a really, really nice spot for Blake Snell today to go over the 17 and a half outs. But now getting into Diaz here, he's a hit in 72% of games this year, but against left-handed pitching, he has hit in 80% of games, 24 out of 30. And if you take a look at games where they win because they are favored today, he's actually even better over in 75% of games. He's also better in wins as well. So a lot of really nice splits here against lefties in wins and also at home. A lot of things that are trending in the right direction for him to have a hit today. He faces Martin Perez today, who has had a rough season. He's a bit of an older pitcher. He has a 4.6 ERA, and he has a ton of plate appearances against Marty Perez as well. He has 26 plate appearances against him. He has a hit in 
in about 40% of the time of plate appearances against him, which is about 10 hits. He's actually been better even as of late because this does, this does factor in a lot of games from 2018, 19, 2020, 2021. Uh, but as of late, he's definitely had a lot more games with a lot of hits against Marty Perez. I'll also take a look at how he's been against the sinker. He has a 318 on base average against the sinker. Cutter, 349. Love to see a lot of those uh, averages there, especially against those top two pitches. So the top two pitches, he is pretty successful against, which he throws, you know, about 67-ish percent of the time, 68 percent of the time. So I'd love to see that a lot there, uh, just him being good against those pitches. So really, that is the first play that I got for you guys in this video. It's going to be Yandy Diaz over a hit to have, for him to have a hit today, and also uh, Blake Snell to go over the 17 half outs. If you're on a sports book, pays that about plus 100, 1.8 X over on prize picks. But what you would do is just pair with like the next play, for example. Now, before we get into play round number two, if you're not already on Sleeper, it offers some of the best payouts. So you get a really good payout for today's plays over on Sleeper. They have a ton of promos, including a free square when you sign up. You have a Joe Burrow free square, and I think you actually might get another one on top of that when you join. You get a first and deposit match up to $100 with promo code DOMG. And on top of that, you also get a protected play right now for college football. You get your first entry back up to $15 if it loses, if it's an only college football entry. So really, really awesome promos going on right now on Sleeper. I mean, I just named off like four different promos. So it's really crazy what they got going on right now. So use that link down in my description, promo code DOMG to get a first and deposit match up to $100. Use that promo link down there. But also the next play is going to be available over on Sleeper. It's the best line that I personally like is available over on Sleeper. There are there are alternatives if you're only on prize picks, but I do prefer this one here. We're going to go over to the Cleveland Guardians and Pittsburgh Pirates game here, and I'm going to scroll down till we find Jose Ramirez over half a run today. So that's what I like for him today, over half a run. Let's take a look at the alternative on prize picks and then get into why I like Jose Ramirez so much. So if you're only on prize picks, you're not interested in joining sleep or anything like that. I do like Jose Ramirez over hits, runs, and RBI since the runs is not available over on prize picks. Although you will get a less of a payout since it is a green goblin. And I don't really necessarily love that. I think hits, runs, and RBIs is more likely to hit, but not by a ton. Uh, let's take a look here at why I like the over for his runs, but it is very, very similar, by the way, to the hits, runs, and RBIs. So if we take a look here at his runs, if we pull this up real quick, he has a run in 56% of games so far this year. And against left-handed pitching, though, he has a run in 71% of games. So pretty huge uptake there. You can see there, uh, compared to right-handed pitching, only over in 49%. Lefties, 71%. Great track record there. Also in wins this year, he's actually over this in 72% of games against lefties and wins over in 81% of games. And he's also a little bit better at home when it comes to scoring runs. So a lot of really great things here uh, for Jose Ramirez. I've, I've taken this quite a few times this year and I've loved it pretty much every single time. I think he's sold me only one time and I probably played it about five times. So I love this prop here a lot. I've taken this plenty of times. Uh, this is a really good matchup too, by the way, against Bailey Falter. He has a 4-2-5 ERA. He has not played Bailey Falter, I do not believe, but the pitch mix against him looks really, really Really good. I mean, uh, Jose Ramirez here with the fastball. He's a 414 weighted on base average against that fastball. He gets a slider 341, curveball 445. I mean, just crushes nearly every single pitch that Bailey Falter throws. Uh, so, especially those high end ones like the fastball, slider, curveball, even the sinker a little bit, he crushes pretty much all those pitches. So, Little spot alive here for Jose Ramirez. I think he gets, uh, you know, on base here. I ho and hopefully his team just drives him in for a run here. Cleveland are pretty heavy favorites there. They're about a minus 170 to win, which is a good sign here if we're looking for some runs here. So I think Jose Ramirez should hopefully be able to score a run in this game here. I also have some more Guardians props, by the way, over on the Dub Club uh, that have already been posted. So don't miss out on joining that. But I'm not done with the free plays, but why not reminder again to join the Dub Club? You guys can get it right now, literally for only $5. For the next two weeks, I'm over $5,000 of profit over on prize picks, so don't miss out on getting all my plays. Link for that is down in my description. Also, don't miss out on joining Outlier. You guys can get in right now seven days for free with the link down in my description. Don't miss out on that seven-day free trial uh, with that promo link down in my description. I personally love this tool. I use it for all my player prop research. But now let's get some more free plays today from the Daily Grind tool. This right here is the Price Picks Optimizer. So it's just the best expected value plays and apps like Price Picks or Underdog. And right now on Price Picks, there's actually some value right now. They actually like Tyree Kill to score a touchdown uh, in the first game of week one. They like that right there. Uh, but if you, if you just click on the refresh button, it pulls the most up-to-date value plays up onto the board. Like right now, that was only a limited time value right there. We didn't have to do any research and we just found a ton of value plays, like some tennis plays. You got some MLB value there, some WNBA value as well. We didn't have to do any research. We just found a ton of value plays right now on the board. And if you're on prize piece, you want like a two pick power play, all you have to do is click on plus V plays, filter it down to like a two pick or a five pick or a six pick flex. So if that tool interests you, use the link down in my description, click on the face bundle and then scroll down. Promo code DMG will get you 25% off. There's also another tool that's separately called the Asset Generator, and this was up over 1,600 units since August 18th, as you can see right there. Let's give you guys a free play here. Let's go with the six-pick flex right now 
over on prize because there's some WNBA value. There's some CSGO, some MLB, some more WNBA, a lot of different value right now on the board. It has a profit margin of 5.27% and it is plus EV. So that's how you guys know that it's expected value. And it is one of the better entries right now on the board that they like. I mean, there's also plays for dabble for other prize picks entries, like five pick right there. There's a six pick insured entry right now on underdog that they like. Uh, and this tool is just insanely good. 1600 units in, you know, a, about a year is insane and pretty much unheard of. So if you guys want this tool, Use that link down in my description. Click on the ASF generator and then scroll down. Promo code DMG will get you 25% off. Thank you for watching. Now, see you hopefully in tomorrow's video. And if you want to save made over $5,000 on prize picks, watch this video right here.